So, how's the mind watching going, John Luke? Oh, fantastic, buddy. You're so right. These thoughts of ill will, the consequences of them are awful. I was playing chess with Pierre, and you know, I, you know, he brought up these awful feelings as he does with that horrid mustache, and I attacked him with the baguette from Donnie's. What? I know. Awful. Absolutely awful consequences, Buddha. You're so right. Such disharmony in the camp. So, what I've realized what I can do now is I get Augustan to tie my hands behind my back so that I don't attack Pierre when these awful thoughts come up. Oh, Jean-Luc, it's not just the consequences of these thoughts that are awful, and I'm grateful that you've learned that, you know, you've learned the consequences of your actions and the consequences of these thoughts and, and feelings. But mind watching also is about, you know, watching that they're awful in themselves. Hmm? What do you mean? Well, like these thoughts you have of ill will and, you know, negativity, they're affecting you more than you think. But Buddha, I made a whole lifetime out of these thoughts. These, I'm so used to these. If I was to let them go, I'm telling you, John, let them go. That's why you keep up the mind watching. Oh, yeah? Yeah, if you let them go, you'll notice less blocks and see what comes into your experience then. All right, Buddha. You're right. I've noticed since watching constantly, I've not only begun to let them go, but there has, there's been more wisdoms come in, more thoughts have come in, more pleasant ones, and there's more harmony in the camp. And plus, I'm saving Augustan. Thanks, Buddha. Thanks for the inspiration. And again, make sure to check out Sabuti's Mind and Harmony for this lesson.